When you compare ambient intelligence to other technology paradigms, there are several things that are different. First, a lot of tech companies today want to take you out of the physical world. We're building devices and services designed to help you spend more time looking up at the world and the people in it, not down at your hands or your phone. It's technology that's there when you need it, but importantly, disappears in the background when you don't. Secondly, it's intuitive. You shouldn't have to learn it. There's no manual. It's beautifully easy to use. It works just as well for my 80-year-old dad as it does for a teenager, and it isn't hidden behind some lock screen. And thirdly, it's both proactive and personal. It acts on your behalf without you having to say or do anything in that moment. And while we absolutely believe in the power of a voice interface, we also believe in a future ambient home that lets you speak to Alexa less. And we've already started putting the building blocks in place. Today, over 30% of smart home actions are initiated by Alexa without customers having to say or do anything. That's thanks to features like routines, which developers are using to drive a 4x increase in customer engagement. And also hunches, which we've made available to device makers, including iRobot. Now you no longer have to ask your Roomba to start vacuuming. Roomba uses Alexa hunches to analyze usage patterns at your home and begins cleaning when it's convenient for you. These experiences are no longer the stuff of science fiction. It's reality. For the past five to 10 years, we've begun the golden age of AI. We've entered this age thanks to how rapidly the fundamental building blocks of artificial intelligence and machine learning have evolved. But our approach to AI and machine learning is different than others. We're not developing technology for technology's sake. We're inventing to meaningfully improve the experience for our customers today. You're gonna hear a lot about these AI advancements here at Alexa Live. Let me give you a couple examples. From the beginning, we designed our devices and services to use a combination of edge and cloud processing. This gives us the best of both worlds, the unlimited computing power and security of the cloud and the performance and privacy benefits of having some processes run on device. We custom designed an AZ-1 Neural Edge processor, which performs trillions of operations a second, and it can accelerate speech recognition processing and also reduce the latency on select Echo devices. And last fall, we built on that with the new product Echo Show 15. It has the AZ-2 processor, which has a quad-core scalable architecture capable of 22 times more than the previous generation. And it can process computer vision, and speech recognition workloads in parallel on the same device. We also had to develop scientific innovations on the software and machine learning side. To enable on-device speech processing, our teams developed from the ground up an end-to-end -end recurrent neural network transducer, sometimes called an RNN-T. That's a model that directly maps input speech signals to an output sequence of words. To do this, we had to develop new techniques, both for inference and for training, to deliver cloud-level accuracy along with improved latency, while achieving a 100 times reduction in model size that's necessary because we had to fit in the constrained environment of the devices. Then there's Alexa Conversations, a deep learning approach to dialogue management that allows developers to build conversational skills on Alexa with far fewer lines of code. Alexa Conversations eliminates the need for developers like you to create and maintain complex dialogue management rules. This year, millions of customers have engaged with Alexa Conversations across hundreds of different experiences. Customers can purchase gifts for their loved ones, they can decide what new book to read, or find the latest news. And there are thousands of developers already building with Alexa Conversations, and I can tell you, we're just getting started. We also built an Alexa teacher model, a pre-trained multilingual model with billions of parameters that learns from language as well as salient patterns of interaction with Alexa. The Alexa teacher model eliminates the need to build new task-specific models for natural language understanding from scratch. Instead, it self-learns new tasks with very few examples. The multilingual nature of Alexa Teacher allows our scientists to train Alexa to support new experiences faster in all of Alexa's supported languages. This provides substantial gains in performance from the same amount of task-specific training data. 
With innovations like this, we allow Alexa to learn with very little human effort and share that learning across tasks and languages at an ever-increasing pace. And finally, you'll hear about what we're doing to help make the smart home more simple and convenient for our customers. There are very few universal truths in the world, but one that I'm sure of is that your home is not going to be homogenous. Every home includes devices from many different companies and brands. As an example, the company who makes your microwave won't be the same company that makes your car. It's our job to make these devices and services work together seamlessly on behalf of our shared customers. That's why from the very beginning, we've architected Alexa to have its brains in the cloud. It's why we've opened up our APIs to developers and why we support multiple smart home standards and protocols, most recently with our support of the Matter standard. Our vision for ambient intelligence isn't something one company can achieve on its own, and we don't want to. On the contrary, this ambient world can only result from continued collaboration between us and each one of you. There are now more than one million registered developers, brands, and device makers building with Alexa. For all of you, ambient intelligence offers new opportunities to engage with your customers, and doing so, it drives growth, engagement, and revenue. In fact, customers have engaged with Alexa skills tens of billions of times over the past year and have connected more than 300 million smart home devices to Alexa. We know you have a choice for who you develop with, and we're so thankful you continue to choose Amazon and Alexa. I can't wait to see what you build, and more importantly, how we can work together to create experiences that enrich and simplify the lives of our common customers.